Hey everybody, so it's Farrah, welcome back to my channel. This one is how to prepare for the makeup. We could all just grab our Fenty and slap it on, but if you want your makeup to look good all day, if you want your makeup to feel good, if you want to just feel really nice, let's just start. First things first is, if you've already brushed your teeth and all your other things, you know, you gotta get prepared. Cleanse your face. You can light cleanse, you can heavy cleanse. Um, personally, I have oily combo skin, so I use a facial wipe. I like a facial wipe you can cleanse if you want to. I just feel like cleansing is kind of overboard doing it, but just cleansing your face with a facial wipe or whatever you want to use, just to get all of the grime or dirt, whatever you got from the night, whatever you picked up from your pillow, your partner, your blanket, just cleansing it off of your face, getting all the oils or whatever that you accumulated, just giving that. It also leaves your face feeling refreshed. So now that your face is all that. If you have a day serum, put it on. I don't use any of those personally, but I do need to moisturize. So I like the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel right now with Hyaluronic Acid. This is my current like thing I'm trying out. So it's the gel product. I just take a dab of that and place it all over my face and then rub it in. I use quite a bit every time just because my face is oily and it needs moisture. If you're really worried about wrinkles, apply an upward motion, never press down. Um, because I'm a lazy shit, I tend to forget who will pull down, but you should push up the whole time. But again, I'm a lazy shit, sometimes I forget. So now you're moisturized. And I think primer, makeup, makeup time. No, stop. I don't care where you live, whether it's always snowy, whether, whatever, uh, even if it's gloomy, put on some goddamn sunscreen right now. So I'm actually trying this out as well. This is the Black Girl Sunscreen SPF 30. I mean, this packaging is the bomb though. So this is made by Black Girl. This is made by Black Girls for Black Girls. It's an ultra sheer moisturizing sunscreen lotion, SPF 30. You need sunscreen every day. Uh, you're supposed to use about a teaspoon's worth of sunscreen. I'm just going to pour that out. And the thing about that whole using a teaspoon worth of sunscreen is for most African Americans, when you put that much sunscreen on, as you see, the zinc in it, or whatever really turns, the zinc in sunscreen turns your ashy and white. This, because once you mix it in, your skin does not give you the flashback or white cast. So we're just gonna blend it in. And again, always wear sunscreen. You. And it leaves you. Boom. No ash. That is that is sickening. This is sickening. No ash. No ash at all. Alright. Your lips are also just as important. I like my Jack Black Intense Therapy lip balm all over my lips. Uh, this is a shea butter one, but it doesn't matter what flavor you use as long as you uh, coat your shell hot. As long as you put some on, it don't really matter what flavor you use. But a nice, thick, moisturizing lip balm. There's a difference between the ones that kind of just leave, you know, protect your lips and the ones that actually moisturize and nourish your lips. You might have to spend a little bit more, but I feel like it's worth it to get the ones that actually nourish. Now, Making time, right? No, no, not making time, not yet. One last thing, the one last thing you need for your skin to be prepared, ready for makeup, ready for you to take on the day, and that is primer. I'm trying this out. These are all things I'm trying out, but I still use this every time I do my makeup. This primer I'm using is a new Tatcha the Silk Canvas Primer. Yes, it's bougie, yes. This is $52. The Black Girl Sunscreen is $25, if I remember correctly, and I got it online. And the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel is about $12 to $13, depending where you purchase it. But this Tatcha Silk Canvas is a primer. And the important thing about primers is 
having that layer in between your skin and your makeup so the makeup isn't getting into your deeply into your pores it's still easy to cleanse out but also this primer is nourishing your skin as well you can put it on don't have to actually wear makeup this primer also is going to make fill your pores so your makeup glides over them easier you're gonna look smooth you're gonna look um, more flawless without having to do face tune your photos online so this one's a little bit more bougie where they have they gave me a, they give you a little thing and you just scrape out what you need so I'm just gonna go and it's you use very little so it's like once you get rice grain worth of product if you can see this this is about how much pro of the product they actually want you to use so 40 for so for 52 dollars I mean it is trying not to make you you aren't using the whole thing all at once it says spray between your fingertips and then apply to the face. Not like your sunscreen. And again, working it in, trying to use upward pushing motions rather than downward ones. From I've tried it a couple times, and from what I realized, it makes a really good um, eye area primer. Like my eye area never has looked better. But if you have really light eyelids, still you know, prime your actual, you know, regions that you get oily, powder them, grind them, your favorite primers. I'm just showing you what I'm using right now. And now, my skin, my skin's ready for makeup. My skin's ready for the day. I'm ready. The sun can't touch me. The wind can't touch me. Life can't touch me. My bills can't touch me. The IRS can't touch me. But I'm ready. So let me go do my makeup and I'll be right back, okay? And we're back. So just look like flawless, radiant skin. I have powder. I got set and spray. I got all my powder. But you know, I got my face beat. But that setup, that, you know, using these things to prepare my skin is gonna let my skin live. And with with and without makeup, I'll still slay. Like, obviously, you see me slaying this look, but when I take this look off, I'm going to still be slaying. Excuse my hair. I washed it, so it's, it, it does the most just right after. But thank you guys so much for coming to another Makeup for Dummies video. I hope this helps you out. I hope this show me, you know, you know, on Instagram. You can tag me, at Solid Sparrow, or you can tag me on Twitter, at Solid Sparrow, and show me what is your preparation. Like, my preparation is on, like, three, four items in the morning my night routine I have like multiple skincare so you just gonna text me okay gotta go pick up my messy from work like always but you know my night routine I have different videos on skincare and what I like in skincare um maybe I'll do an updated video I don't know but nevertheless there's tons of other videos on my channel you should go watch and I'm gonna put out a new one every now and then you can just go ahead and subscribe hit that bell button if you want to know exactly when a new video comes out but there will always be a newer funner video to watch so I got some old ones I got some new ones I got something for you anyway thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you guys next time okay bye